learning objectives. After completing this module, learners will be able to define minerals and power resources, name the types of minerals and their basis of classification with examples, specify the regions of availability of minerals, list the methods of extraction of minerals, differentiate between the types of energy resources and list their examples, Describe conventional and non-conventional sources of energy. Locate major minerals on map. Types of mineral and their extraction. Minerals. Mineral is defined as a naturally occurring substance that has a fixed composition. Example, iron, copper, gold, silver. Types of minerals Metallic minerals Minerals which contain raw forms of metal are called metallic minerals. Example, iron ore, bauxite and manganese ore. Metallic minerals can be ferrous. Ferrous minerals are those which contain iron. Example, iron ore, manganese and chromates. Non-ferrous Non-ferrous minerals are those which do not contain iron. Example, gold, silver, copper and lead. Non-metallic minerals Non-metallic minerals are defined as the minerals which do not contain metals. Example, limestone, mica and gypsum. Extraction of minerals Mining Mining is defined as the process of taking out minerals from rocks buried under the earth's surface. Mining is of two types. Open cast mining. Open cast mining is defined as the process of taking out the minerals that lies at shallow depths by removing surface layer of earth. Example, coal. Shaft mining. Shaft mining is defined as the process of making deep holes called shafts to reach mineral deposit that lie deep below the earth's surface. Drilling Drilling is defined as the process of taking out minerals from deep wells by boring or making holes. Example, petrol and natural gas. Quarrying Quarrying is defined as the process of extracting minerals lying near the earth's surface by simply digging. Distribution of minerals Minerals occur in different types of rocks, namely metamorphic rocks, igneous rocks, sedimentary rocks. Examples of minerals found in igneous and metamorphic rocks iron ore in North Sweden, copper and nickel deposits in Ontario, Canada, iron, nickel, chromite and platinum in South Africa, sedimentary rock formations of plains and young fold mountains consists of non-metallic minerals like limestone deposits of Caucasus region manganese deposits of Georgia and Ukraine, phosphate beds of Algeria. Mineral fuels like coal and petroleum are found in sedimentary strata. Mineral resource in different continents. Asia, China and India, largest deposit of iron ore. China, Malaysia and Indonesia, world's leading producers of tin china lead antimony tungsten asia also has deposits of manganese bauxite nickel zinc and copper europe leading producer of iron ore in the world countries with large deposit of iron ore russia ukraine sweden france 
Eastern Europe and European Russia have mineral deposits of copper, lead, zinc, manganese and nickel. North America, Canadian region north of Great Lakes, iron ore, nickel, gold, uranium, copper are found. Appalachian region for coal. Mountain ranges on the west, copper, zinc, gold and silver are found. South America, Brazil, largest producer of high-grade iron ore in the world, Chile and Peru, producers of copper, Brazil and Bolivia, world's largest producer of tin, South America has large deposits of gold, silver, zinc, chromium, manganese, bauxite, mica, platinum, asbestos and diamond. Mineral oils are found in Venezuela, Argentina, Chile, Peru, Colombia. Africa, world's largest producer of uses of minerals. Uses of minerals. Minerals which are hard and precious are used as gems in jewellery. Copper is used in almost everything from coins to pipes. Silicon is used in the computer industry. It is obtained from quartz. Aluminium is used in automobile, airplanes, bottling industry and building and in kitchen cookware. It is obtained from bauxite. Conservation of Minerals Minerals are the non-renewable resources. It is necessary to reduce wastage in process of mining. Recycling of metals is one of the ways to conserve mineral resources. Power Resources Power resources are of two types. Conventional resources, non-conventional resources. Power resources are needed for industry, agriculture, transport, communication and defence. Conventional sources of minerals The energy resources which are in common use from a long time are known as conventional sources. Example, firewood and fossil fuels. Coal Coal is a major conventional energy source. Coal we use today was formed from the remains of the trees and ferns grew in swarms around 500 million years ago. Coal is therefore known as buried sunshine. Electricity generated from coal is called thermal power. Important coal fields are Talcher, Raniganj, Jharia, Bokaro, etc. Petroleum it occurs below the Earth's crust and trapped under rocky strata. In its crude form, the viscous black liquid is known as petroleum and a gas in contact with petroleum layer which flows naturally from oil wells is termed as natural gas. The crude petroleum, after being refined and purified, are available as petrol, diesel, kerosene, lubricating oil, plastic, etc. for commercial and domestic use. In India, the oil deposits are found at Ganga Brahmaputra Valley, Bombay High, Plains of Gujarat, etc. On the world basis, petroleum deposits are found at Saudi Arabia, Iraq, Iran, Kuwait, USA, Mexico, Russia, etc. Non-conventional sources of energy Solar energy Heat and light from the sun is trapped in solar cells to produce electricity. Many cells are joined to form solar panels to generate power. A lot of tropical countries that have abundant sunshine are using this technology for their electric consumption. Example, solar heaters, solar cookers, solar dryers. Wind energy. The wind is an inexhaustible, clean, free 
and readily available renewable energy source. Windmills are capturing the wind's power and converting it to electricity. They are also used for grinding grain and lifting water. In India, wind farms or cluster of windmills are found in coastal regions, mountain passes. In world, wind farms are found Netherlands, Germany, Denmark, UK, USA, Spain. Nuclear power. It is obtained from energy stored in the nuclei of atoms of naturally occurring radioactive elements like uranium and thorium. These fuels undergo nuclear fission in nuclear reactors and emit power. Greatest producers of nuclear power are USA and Europe. India has large deposits of uranium in Rajasthan and Charkhand. Thorium is found in monazite sands of Kerala. Nuclear power stations in India are found in Kalpakam, Tamil Nadu, Tarapur, Maharashtra, Rana Pratap Sagar near Kota, Rajasthan, Narora, UP, Kaiga, Karnataka. Geothermal energy is the heat energy obtained from the earth. It can also be used to generate power. Geothermal energy in the form of hot spring can be used in cooking, heating, bathing. World's largest geothermal power plants are in USA, New Zealand, Iceland, Philippines, Central America. In India, the geothermal plants are in Manikaran, Himachal Pradesh, Puga Valley, Ladakh. Tidal energy it is the energy generated from tides. It can be harnessed by building dams at narrow openings of sea. During high tide, the energy produced from the tides is used to rotate the turbine installed in the dam to produce... Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Any naturally occurring substance that has definite composition is called a mineral. Minerals are divided into two types, metallic and non-metallic minerals. Methods like mining, drilling and quarrying are used for extraction of minerals. Minerals like iron ore, copper, nickel, chromite, platinum are found in igneous and metamorphic rocks. Limestone is found in sedimentary rocks. Asia has large iron ore deposits. Europe is leading producer of iron ore. Major minerals found in India are iron, bauxite, mica, copper, manganese, limestone, gold, salt. Minerals are used in many industries like in jewellery, making coins, aeroplanes, etc. Power resources are of two types, conventional and non-conventional power resources. Firewood, petroleum, coal, natural gas, hydel power are conventional sources. 